Hey guys, Sean C. Phillips here and MJ Kelly, and we may look a little pale. We didn't have much sleep tonight at all. But we're going to here to show you all the things we got in our P.O. box over the last probably three weeks, two or three weeks. And as you know, the address for the P.O. box is on the side of the video. And we're doing this video th with this camera, and it's not backwards like last time. Remember how last time everything got reversed? Oh, yeah. Now, first we got a letter from India. From... Adjata. Hopefully we said that right. It's like, it's like a unique kind of like thing. Right, this is like a unique kind of envelope. It's like I don't even know how you open it. It's like this way. It's neat. Hi Sean and MJ. My name is Adjata. And I'm from Punjab, India. I can't express in words how great I feel watching you guys on YouTube, especially your around the town videos and your short films. I recently watched your horror films, your film Vampires Lost, The Cage Grown Lost for Blood. You guys have done a brilliant job. I'm deeply inspired by your work because of which I'm now going to make my own short feature film along with some of my friends. You guys are an inspiration for a lot of young directors, including me. I've seen the way you guys act. You guys have an excellent com comedic timing. And if this goes on, I sincerely believe both of you will be legendary comedians one day. Well, thank you. Thanks so much. When I make my first film, you guys will be the first of whom I send the DVD. I will also send some movies that I like. I, I look forward to seeing that. And there's a Q&A. Have you guys ever seen any film, gone to any film or acting school? Well, we both had like an acting classes and we both went to an acting at film school as well what are your forthcoming projects well i guess the one that we just did was the severed in yeah and then i did one for president's day trailer park living dead and then um some other ones we can't mention yet until we start doing them how did you both meet and when well we both met in um the sixth grade yep and we were introduced by a guy named sean not me Another Sean. And like he, he was actually in one of our videos too. What are your extra hobbies ex except acting and filmmaking? Probably collecting movies, going. One's collecting movies, one's video games, action figures. Um, yeah, toys. I have a lot of collect toys. But I don't collect like, you know, kids' toys. I collect like, collect movie toys and yeah, classic mine's like toys. Music, a lot of action figures. With love and regards and best of luck for the future, your buddy Ajita. The channel www.youtube slash a k s s s u upper man thanks thank you now this is from elizabeth what mother Headroom on us, do you think? No, I'm sorry. Just, oh, but... Dear Sean and MJ, I just wanted to tell you guys that you are a very talented. I love your videos. My favorite are Murph's Blind Date, Don's Blind Date, Boys Club, Deviate 3, and Friday the 13th Movie Review. All of them are awesome. I would like to see you guys do more short films. I know you guys are probably too busy, but I hope you can check out my videos. My username is Office fan two three four. P.S. Are you a fan of Corey Hain? Yes. Mm -hmm. But Corey Hain and Feldman. If if so, you need to check out his introduction to film First First War. Sadly, it was never released to DVD, but you can order a copy off Amazon.com. From Jason. I don't think I've have you seen that one in there? First First Born. How come it said from Jason, but the thing said Elizabeth? I don't know. Well, thanks, Jason or Elizabeth. This is from Miles. These guys are the same age as you, MJ. I didn't send something to us. Did you send this to yourself? Like, I really want you to see this. So I sent it. Wow. Michael Moore. Really? No, I think it's him with Michael Moore. I, I enjoy your show along with my... 
all the various reviews and clips you post on YouTube. This is my film, Fat Boy the Movie. It's distributed by Ink and Pictures and won five awards on the film festival circuit. It's a documentary, yet yeah, it's very funny and entertaining. Fat Boy is one of the few documentaries you see that has you feeling good. I included a photo of myself and Michael Moore at the Fort Lauderdale Film Festival where I was presented the award for Best Doc. I figured I'd pass it along to both of you and see what you thought. I enjoy... If you enjoyed, stick around after the credits for a special scene. Also, the commentary is worth checking out if you want to get a deeper, deeper into my battle with weight loss and personal growth. Oh, I, and don't forget to tell your viewers that Fat Boy is one word when searching via Netflix, retail stores, or Google. P.S. I signed the pick, but I don't really feel like if you don't like it, you don't need to keep it. I just signed it in case you desire such a thing. This looks interesting for a fat guy like me, MJ. I think it's about like a guy losing weight. I'm, I, I'm, I definitely want to watch that. Fat boy. And here's a picture of him and Michael Moore. People. What? Nothing. Are you making jokes about my seats impediments, Andre? You had it wipe off on me a few times. Now this is from McLeod. Sean, this is a rough cut, so the beginning is a little clunky. Hope you like it. Rick McLeod. Oh, it's the trailer, the Unholy Reunion film. I definitely want to check that out. And now this is from Kenny, a.k.a. YouTube user C-I-M-O-Z-Z-E-N. Oh, it's a classic VHS, MJ. Oh. Dear Sean and MJ, the 11-year-old kid who only likes the 80s. I've included a film called The Granny. It was directed by the guy that directed the first Ghoulies. I've not seen that. I've heard of this a lot, though. Here is a, a heads up. In October, there will be a horror convention in Chicago. The two girls from Ginger Snaps will be there and a bunch of other celebs. I think it is something you might like. Remember, it's like in, in um, Prom Trap. I th I'm having a party. I think it would be nice if you came. Here, my reviews on, are on my channel. I have two playlists, Season 1 and Season 2 reviews. The movie I, I've included only 10... The movie I've included, only 10 DVD copies are known to exist, and I own one. A lot of the actors actually watch my review. Turn over. You ever read the front? Read now. Your idol, John Blight, watches my reviews. The director of Slime City watches my reviews. The star of Kill Clowns in Modern Space watches my reviews. I made two tributes to you guys, Best of Cool Duder and me watching Don and Murph. My channel, again, is Simpson, C-I-M-O-Z-Z-E-N. Can you please subscribe? We will. And questions. Where did you get the on-air sign, Tarjay? And Sean, where are you going to fix, fit your DVDs? Are you going to fit, fix any more DVDs or shelves? Yeah, I do have to get more shelves. This 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 movie I remember hearing a lot about the Granny, and I did not see it. I think I saw this one, one of the second guy's video. I think he took. I know I watched some of his videos. I think he took pictures out of our Facebook photos for that. I know, I know, I watched. Is what you will do. And this is from Donnie. It was lucky at the P.O. Box that we even got the stuff because there was no slip in there that we had anything. We just asked and we had all this stuff. Yeah. Which we would have not gotten if we didn't. If we went next week, there would have been twice as much. And then they would have called us and said, get that stuff now or we're going to send it all back. They said they, they called me one day and threatened me like that. I was like, Jeez, a butt, a butt. Thorn MJ, I appreciate that's a cool cover. I appreciate your DVD reviews, especially your love for Halloween three, season of the witch. Matt. Take care, Matt. 
YouTube channel Matthew Frame. M A T T H E W F R A M E. This is cool. This is a new copy of the Wheelies with a better cover. That is really cool. Look at that cover on that. That is a good cover. Thanks, Donnie, or Matt, or whichever you Matt. are. Yeah, so it's funny. People have like other names, and it's like when it says like Donnie there, but then it says Matt, the other one. One it's says like, Elizabeth, the other one says Jason. We have the next package, and the last package is from a person we've gotten a lot of stuff from. It's Frank. Oh, Frank. Oh, I knew you'd come through, Frank. Frank sent us so many things. Thank you, Frank. You're the best, Frank. And we didn't pre-open those, Frank. We so. wanted to, though. Every time we get something from you, we just want to open it and see what it is, Frank. Andre was just watching Junior. Were you, did you enjoy Junior so far, Andre? Yeah, that part when he had that nightmare about that baby just freaked me out. I'm sorry we're struggling with the box. Every time I open this, I feel like this is the way Ernest would open a box. You know what I mean? Be like... <clears throat> Ernest, would you like a pair of scissors? And then right when he gets it open. <sighs> Ernest, would you like some scissors? Oh, like, oh. that'd be very much appreciated, <laughs> little me. Uh, all right, here we go. All right. More, more stuff. Dear Sean and MJ, share the stuff that's in the box. MJ should check out the Ghostbusters music video. John Candy did a cameo in the Ghostbusters music video. Oh, I remember that. John Candy turned down the role of Lewis in Ghostbusters and also turned down the role of Wayne in Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. I didn't know that. I never knew that. I remember that. I did. Did. Do you have SCTV? John Candy was in it. SCTV is a TV show from Canada, Sean. Do you have the movie called Chopping Mall? It takes place in 80s Mall from Frank. And actually, I do have that Chopping Mall. And I like SCTV. Zombies ate my neighbors. Oh, no, that's cool. I wanted to play that again. I remember playing this when I had a broken leg. Like, I, I was ice skating. Wow. And then I remember we hooked the TV up in, this, in the room and I played this. This is a good game. Mario toys. There's Pirates of the Crimson Seas cards. Oh, this, this is, this is music. Ren and Tri Stimpy, Crunk O' Christmas. Oh, that's cool. Oh, God, I used to have one of these. Look, it's one of the little, little Goombas. Could I have this one? Yes, you can, MJ. You can have whatever you'd like. The Wayne's Brothers presents Dozers. Wayne's Brothers cars. What did I say? Wayne's Brothers? Yeah. Speedy Gonzulas. You want that or should I have it? If you like it, MJ, you can have it. Well, thank you. Can I have this for an Simpy game? Okay. Firehouse Dogs. It's got any Mo like Mario or anything cool like that in there. I definitely want to. There's another Ren and Stimpy game. There's a bunch of them. There's another one. Rain and Stimpy's Time Warp. Would you like this one or can I have it? Um. Do you want it? I'd like it, but if you want it. Rain and Stimpy. Oh, God, look. Buckle, this, I, remember the, I remember the Angry Video Game Nerd reviewed this. Fester's Quest. Do you remember that? No. I remember that. Who would like. Would you like this? Which one would you like? I guess I'll take this one. And I'll get Fester's Quest. I'll go through all the prompts he did. Oh, this is cool. Toxic Crusaders. Lloyd Kaufman's game. Donkey Kong 3. I gotta have this one. You can have it, Andrew. Anything Donkey you like. Kong, Donkey Kong 3. Do you want Bugs... Oh, geez, didn't... 
Any video game nerd review that too? Birthday blowout. I remember this one. I loved this one. You can have that, MJ. This is cool. Swamp Thing, the game. I don't remember that. Swamp Thing. That's cool. A lot of cool ones in here, Lego. <coughs> Frankenstein, the monster returns. Castle of Dragon. Or Dragon. Castle of Dragon. Uh, Castle of Dragon. Castle of Dragon, MJ. <gasps> oh, this one's got to be. All right, mine. MJ, you can have it. Yoshi's Cookie. I got to have this one. Robocop, the game. And there's Robocop 2. Which Robocop do you want, MJ? Do you want one or two? I want one. All right, I'll have the sequel. Oh, wait. No. <laughs> you tried to jip me. No, I didn't. I had the exact same mistake. Skate or die. Wow. That's like a cool 90s cover. You think how much era played this game? British era. I don't know. Maybe. I think it's in the Mall of America, too. I'm going to take that and look at that cover. Out. This is another old one. Skate or die. Skate or die, the other one. Do you want this one? Okay, I'll have the other one. Here, oh, here's another one for you. Yoshi. Yoshi. This one is so mine. Trailer Park of Terror. Terror. Trailer Park, Trailer Park ter of Terror comic book. Let's go through these ones. Qbert. Qbert. Do you remember everyone like, always talk about Qbert? Qbert. It's my, 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 mine. What about Duke of Nukem? The Duke of... You can have the but, Duke. Can I have Butt Duke of Nukem? Go ahead and take Butt Duke of Nukem. Do you want med Medieval Evil 1 and 2? Medieval Evil, PlayStation. And Kiss. I'll have Medi Medieval Evil. I'll take this Kiss pinball game. Oh, Drawn Together Season 1 and 2. Can I have those? Can I have one of them? One of them? Which one do you want? Well, Season 1. Alright, I'll have the second one. Even though I'm probably going to miss out. I don't, I don't know, I've actually never seen this before. I, I I've doubt, seen parts of it. I like this show. My dad is one you have to see from any specific way, though. What is this? What is it? Sucky Duckling? Oh, Sitting Duck. <laughs> sitting Duck? What system is that for? It's a movie or something. Can I have it? It's a TV show. All right, MJ. Let me see. Sitting Ducks. You can have this thing. You can, like, put air, you know, like, like that. You can have this. Do you want this Mario thing? Yeah. Okay. And this is that, like... I love these. Cheese doodle dude. These are these things you try to... That guy. There's a bunch of little figurines. Do you want this Captain America? Okay. And the Simpsons, these are the classic... These were the ones from Burger King years ago. Which one of, the, which one of these would you like? I'm trying to share them, Jay. You can have those ones. Oh, I don't want them. Would you like this, you Luigi? I used to have this. I think I remember seeing that. You think this was mine? Luigi on a cloud. And there's another. Yeah, these are classic ones. I'm gonna put these up on the shelf. And look, the Adams Family games. The Adams Family and the Adams Family values. A lot of games in here today. Ah, real monsters. Oh, jeez. Here, oh, here's a pack of these for you. The Wayne's Brothers cards. Wayne's Brothers. There's a Wildy Coyote card. Do you want our real monsters? You can have it, MJ. Oh. Here's a whole evening right here. Here's Castlevania. Would you like that? Sure. Castlevania. Oh God! Look, these I've got. I've got to have this. What? Family Dog, the game. And there's Jurassic, Jurassic Park. Park. All right, MJ. Great movie. I'm I did not remember there was a game for that. They put in a game Actually, for everything. I think I might have played that. They made a game for everything back in the day. The bed. last thing in here is a Pirates of the Caribbean toy, a plush thing. Well, thank you, Frank. You sent some cool stuff. Thanks. And thank you to everyone else for the things as well. So, we'll see you all in a couple weeks again at the P.O. Box. Thanks again, everybody. Thanks. Bye. Bye.